Hi everyone and welcome to Richard's Motor Sales RV Center. And today we're in Quincy, Michigan with a 2016 Forest River Salem travel trailer. It's uh, probably our best selling, most popular two bedroom model. And it's a uh, 30KQ BSS floor plan. And we'll show you a few things outside and some highlights inside as well. For starters, it's a large outside kitchen model with a three cubic foot refrigerator, hot and cold running water plumbed in to the holding tanks, and a lot of storage. Nice outside kitchen, durable exterior countertops, and the bumper mounted gas grill swings around and joins uh, the kitchen and patio awning side of the coach, which is great. Uh, so we do have exterior cooking. While we're in the back, this is a good look at the power stabilizer jacks. This unit has what we call a power package, which are four power stabilizers. They can be extended or retracted from the manual switch there or the remote control that's provided inside. And we have a power patio awning. In this case, it's 16 feet with LED lighting to light the campsite. And the third thing is our power front tongue jack that's lighted as well to light the front of the campsite, especially when it's dark with the A-frame out here being dark. It's a little safer for kids. Front storage is extra large in this unit, passes through to the other side and is accessible from under the bed. It's also, um, I'll turn one on here, LED lighted. So the new 16 Salem's are our full LED lights throughout like a lot of our brands and um, the awning hook and stabilizer jack tool have a self storing area which is really clever so we'll go in we have a radius skid proof uh, triple entry step and then we go in on plankwood linoleum which is great a great camping uh, cabin look so this is a front master this trailer is about 30 feet of box with three feet of tongue and it's called a 30 footer uh, a couple things the front master has its own AC and furnace and we don't have curtains we have real pocket doors that shut uh, for privacy or division and uh, reading lights above the bed storage under the bed as well and then a really cool little feature is the uh, is the laundry chute in the master that goes down to a um, laundry basket and can easily be removed from an outside luggage door but here's what differs from floor plan to floor plan the amount of space between the bed and the back wall is is um, more than usual anyways and it's 20 or 24 inches so we have room to get through in this floor plan which is a luxury and if somebody wanted to they could put a longer 80 inch mattress on this without any issues of, of um, intruding on like the door area. So here's our great room. One big slide room. The rooms go out 38 inches and we have a mega booth dinette. And Salem's table is, is they always do a really good job with, uh, it's a heavy table, this is a double pedestal. This makes a sleeper and it's like 85 by 50 so it's a good sized uh, extra overflow sleeper and then we do have a 40 inch uh, 40 inch storage drawer that goes underneath one side which is great for overflow pots and pans electric skillet and so on um, this decor is called mineral and really it's a dark saddle leaning towards black leather with fabric on the seat and back in the u dinette and a lot of natural light. There's a panoramic picture window at the dinette area with a, and half of it is ventable screen, so that's really smart. So, looking from back to front, here's our entertainment center, and it's called a dual vision entertainment center. So, we pull the pin, and this will swivel around, and the TV will join the front bedroom if we want it to. So the TV's tied into the DVD, CD, AM, FM, and outside and interior speakers with surround sound, which is, is a better way to listen to uh, movies or TV anyways, and a signal booster for the TV antenna and so on. 
Um, a lot of our Salem's have this half barrel feature. They've peninsulated out the countertop here instead of a straight counter. That really makes a mid kitchen more spacious is to offset the sink and the outside and not have it back here. So we end up with two counter, extra pieces of counter space, which is a luxury in a travel trailer and this has it. So the uh, half barreled storage is hinged and it has a locking device so it will lock and travel and it's another really good use of space that otherwise wouldn't be there. Doors and drawers, purpose belt waste basket spot, and like all of our Coachman and Salem's, a really nice plywood, well built silverware drawer. We have stainless steel appliance package, which really looks nice, a little bit contemporary, and uh, a lot residential, I suppose. It's uh, microwaves of one cubic foot and the range hood. We um, have an igniter for the uh, range top. We have a a 9000 BTU high output front boiling burner and two 4500 BTUs in the back so we don't need a match for that we do for the for the oven and our double door refrigerator is nice um, and let's show you the back here before we run out of too much time but this um, this area and I'll back up is ties in with our kitchen and uh, it's our big pantry so that really is great finish on a trailer this size I've always thought it's easy to put a lot of things in a 38 footer the challenge is at 30 feet or under to make everything fit well and they've done a great job with this fabric shades on the windows um, and I'll show you the bathroom I don't have any lights on in the bathroom and the skylight and, and the roof vent um, lid which are translucent really let a lot of natural light in we gain a little bit of ceiling height if somebody is over six three or four they can fit better so we have a tub shower combo a nice vanity sink actually have some counter space to the left of the sink in the bathroom and a couple little bathroom finished features toothbrush holder towel rack ground fold outlets for hair dryers and so on and uh, medicine cabinet of course and a foot pedal flush toilet so a nice side aisle bathroom here's the kids room and in this configuration remember we have an outside camp kitchen on the door or on inside of this coach so they've put an integrated ladder here one overhead bunk very important and much needed storage uh, two storage areas for the kids for clothes and for toys and then a purpose-built entertainment center hookup uh, there as well so across from that bunk we have a second bunk that folds up and below it we have um, a kids eat and run dinette set with a nice window and um, so this is really a really comfortable triple in uh, one way or the other so it'll sleep three and again uh, two two on the u dinette and one uh, is really more comfortable than two on the on the sofa so that's a look ducted central air high output furnace very nice finish we have plywood 5 8 flooring and walkable 3 8 plywood roof decking it's a forest river product and we are are really happy with our association with uh, the salem group and uh, they just do a great job in design innovation support and um, build a really sturdy product that's probably what we like best about this is our Salem product uh, once we perform the dealer prep on it um, we for the most part don't see them again so very nice unit this is a 30 kqb ss outside kitchen single super slide with a power package on it we sell this in the high teens so we we sell this on sale consistently for under twenty thousand dollars and it's probably the most trailer on our lot for under twenty thousand dollars uh, there's a look we stock several of these at both locations, our home office in Reading, Michigan, and at our newer satellite location in the Coldwater Quincy area. I'm Steve with Richards Motor Sales RV Center. Go RVing, focus on your family, and God bless.